Tower Crane's uh, job essentially is to enable human beings to, uh, you know, elevate from the ground and reach uh, greater heights. In a few years to come, we will start seeing um, robots and um, drones building. But as, as, as we are for now, majority of the people who are doing construction, or rather the majority of methods of construction is through the human hand. So the crane helps the human beings to elevate and be able to be at a height where they're able to access, take materials up, and be able to construct. Well, there's the, the items in terms of there could be components, you know, like a big panel or, or, or a big um, metal member to a, a you know, a steel member. It could be uh, raw materials like a mixture of, of, of concrete. It could be things like uh, cement, bags of cement being taken up to a higher level and, 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 and all that. And, and, you know, in some cases right now, they're also looking at... Uh, even when you are, they are building up these things, they end up using, uh, creating the lifts, um, which are like temporary, okay, the hoists. They, they, there is, there's a lot of things that are, that are being carried up there. It's just an issue of saying that, the size of it is what requires to be carried. Of course, if you're looking at like an apartment, you'd have uh, you know people carrying cement on their on their backs. Yeah, you see the same same items are the ones which are being carried by lifts. Of course, the lifts carry them up faster. Okay, and and of course more load. It could also be hoisting people because you see a crane will not be able to take people up there. Okay, it might be taking materials, but then you also need people to go up there as well. Yeah, and any other small elements that it might be, you know, not difficult to use a lift. If you look at cranes, how they are done, is that they are prefabricated. So the parts are done off-site, and then they are brought to site. It's an equipment that you can quickly put, bolt up, yeah, and then be able to scale the height. The higher the building, the more sophisticated the crane is, okay, and the more critical a crane is. So, I mean, uh, we, you will start seeing more and more. In some cases, you've actually even seen um, a building which part of the building becomes a crane. As you build up, the crane is mounted on the building. So the part of the building from below becomes sort of like the base of the crane, and the crane is part of the building, and, you know, they keep going up. The building and then the rest of the building is done with that crane that is mounted on on this let's say like the core you know where the lift and everything will be every every personnel on a site is very critical right from that Mama who's serving uh, food to the workers, nourishing the workers, uh, to the guy who's operating a crane, because it's a very sensitive uh, uh, job, and it's mostly to do with uh, safety on site, okay? Um, one, it's a dizzying job. I mean, I will, I will not even want to be that guy. It's dizzying. It requires a lot of control 
to a level where um, if for example one small mistake yeah you know the loads is carrying up there are quite heavy and it can they can cause a lot of damage so the level of control is of course there will be the communications the person on the ground being able to give directions and all that but at the same time it's a balancing act and most of these guys what they do is that they just have to have a very level mind because their job is as much as it's an important thing of lifting materials it's a it's, it's a safety issue on site okay one wrong mistake and you can have a lot of injuries or a lot of uh, demolitions or abortive uh, works that needs to be corrected we have been able to build higher and higher because of the lifts okay uh, sorry because of the cranes okay we also been able to even the lifts themselves maybe i may put it that way the 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 the, 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 the beauty about all this is that if you look at how we are going in terms of the construction we are actually trying to find other means of doing it um you, i'm sure you've seen in other uh, maybe not in kenya but in other countries where they've used an a, a helicopter to elevate some panels okay because of other conditions that are maybe you're not able to do the crane okay the crane maybe because of the of the the wind because of the ground conditions because of the cost of maybe putting up the or, or, or the where the crane will stand on and these are the things when you talk about construction machinery it will be getting more complicated and more sophisticated <laughs>